Hello, Maria. Back again. <laughs> How's the desert? Very windy. Wow. Windy it was really here. blowing so I hard. Took, I just took down my umbrella. Where are you? Here. It's really cold in LA. Cold? I'm home. I was about I want to get out of here. here but it was sunny it was it was sunny no. but wow it was blue crazy it was cold here but i did play tennis today oh good okay <laughs> you know where i played they have new courts in west hollywood on top of the library they're awesome they built this oh one on center center yeah it's gorgeous across from the design center yes don't use the men's rooms there though be careful true in fact, well, my, tennis go... my tennis coach showed up with a little dog, you know, he's this Italian yeah. dude, you know, and we looked like. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny. I'll just see a picture of that. This little dog, this little white fluffy dog, you know. Oh, that was funny. Kenny, your internet is bad. Mine is bad. Okay, hold on. Change. We have a little slow. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Bad. Let's see here. Okay. Oh, it's off. That's why it's bad. It's off. Turn it on. Okay. Uh, there you go. how about that one? How's that better? No, no. You sound no, better. Still bad. Still bad. I mean, if you can hear, it's okay. Oh, here, how about that one? No. You sound better. You're little, your movements are slow. Good enough. Yeah, all I got to do is listen, right? <laughs> okay, we're on Zion. Chagiga uh, Zion. Tananazim. Elu Dvarim Shem Shir. This is a, a mission that we say every morning. The following things don't have a shear. Apeya, leaving a corner of your field. Vabikurim, first fruits. Varayon, the mitzvah of Ri'ia, of Oilas Ri'ia. Ugminas chasadim, the Talmud Torah. Arma Vyechnon. You would think that when we say there's no shear for the oil of Sri, that means you, you could always bring more and more and more. But yesh shear lamata. We have a shear the bottom, right? It's got to be a certain amount of money, like we learned in the Mishnah. There's no shear really. So the Gemara asks Maya Ryan, what do we mean? What's Ryan? Just that you have to physically show up with your face in the Azor. You have to come to the base of Migdash. It's not just that you can show up as an individual, you got to bring a Corbin. Now, the Ikara Regal. On Yontif, Kulamalot Plikidri has put in the Corbin. There's no Machlokas, then you have to bring a Corbin. Corbin oil. Keep Pliki Bishayim Osarekha, the rest of the Yontif. Do we say Kolecha de Asiv Aisi? The rest of Yontif. Every time he visits the base of Migdash, he has to bring a Corbin.
Now, there's no shy that if he brought a Corbin, we'd accept it. Keep Pligi the Os of Allah, I see. The Machloka says he came visiting, but he didn't bring a Corbin. Rabbi Yochanan Savar, he has funny buzzer to call Amos to Os, he At this time, when it's not the Yont of itself, he can come as many times as he wants. And he doesn't have to bring a Corbin. And there's no shear. He can come as many times as he wants. According to Rishlogi, no, you can't just stam as I come. If you're going to come, you got to come with a Corbin. It says, If you're going to come and see me, you don't come empty handed. Yeah, but that's on Yont- the first day of Yontif. <laughs> And it says, Does that mean you have to come with a Corbin? Maybe you can come with birds or mincha, the dinu. And it's a kavachomer. The private individual was told that you have to be a, you have to bring a shalme chagiga. You have to bring a chagiga Corbin. The Nemeri, you look at And it says that you have to bring a Corbin Re'iyah. Ma Chagiga Mor Le'ed, Yo, it's Vachim. Now, what is the Corbin Chagiga? It's not birds. It's not a Mincha. It's a it's an animal. Afri'iyah, Mor Le'gavoya. When we say, you have to bring a Corbin La'ashem, and Yontif, that's an Oilas, it's got to be a Zevach, an animal. Umayin Zvachim, Oilas. Now, maybe it could be a shlamim. And the dinu, never chagigaled, you've never really gavoy, ma chagigamaled, you're at Baroilo. You bring a Corbin shlamim, which most of it's eaten. Maybe Afriyab Mura the Gavoya Baroilo. Maybe part of the oil, part of the shlamim goes to Hashem, but maybe it should be similar to Chagiga, which is Roy to the master as well, to the owner himself. No, so the Gemara says Afri Amur by Lagavoy Veroy Loy. Wait, is Corbin Chagiga and Corbin Reiya two separate things? Absolutely. So then, what's the Shaila? No, then, because then Reiya has to be any time you go to the base of Megdash. So the Gemara, the preface that we've done so far tonight, everyone agrees on Yon Tov Rishon, you have to bring a Corbin Oilus Reiya. Now let's say it's the third day of Cholamoid. That's where the Machlekes comes in. Rav Yechelen says you can show up and visit. You've shown your face, but you don't have to bring a Corbin. And Shlach. everybody doesn't bring their own Chagiga? Chagiga is just a Corbin Sibor? No, everyone brings their own Corbin Chagiga. So if, you go to, if you go to the base of Migdash on, forget Pesach. You have to bring Kenny. You have to bring two you have to bring three, three. Then there's Shalmei Simcha. Let's go through it. The Corbin Chagiga that the individual person had to bring, that only males were chayiv, is shlomim. And you use that as your meat that you ate yontif night, yontif lunch. Okay. But ain simcha ela bebosser. And then the yayin, but certainly bosser. And women are chayiv in bosser, in that simcha. So you had to bring other korbane shlomim along with you to shecht and to be able to eat meat, yontif. Now that could be, let's say three months before you were at home and you wanted to bring a neder, harei zu shlomi, harei alai shlomi, a neder or nedova. You could wait and bring that up on yontif for your shalmei simcha, not the korban chagiga. Korban chagiga had to be designated, this is the korban chagiga, boom. So, so far you have two korbanos. Then you had a third Corbin. You had to bring an Ola, which is an animal that was burnt by Hashem. So you brought a Corbin Chagiga, which is a Shlomim that you ate. You brought an Oila Sri'iya that you offered. And you also brought Shal- Shalmei Simcha, usually. If you were a small family, maybe you could get away without the Shalmei Simcha. Got it. Got it? Okay. okay. Now the Gemara was trying to prove, how do you have to bring animals? Maybe Oifois and Menachois. So that's why it says just like for us for the head because we can eat it 
For Kodesh Baruch Hu, it's an oila, which is roi for him. It makes sense. Because what? Your table is going to be full of meat and the table of your, of your master Hashem is going to be empty. So that's a raya, perhaps like Reish Lakish, that you have to bring a korban, even cholamoid. no baker regal. That mission is talking about first day of Yontif. We all we agree that that you have to bring, you have to bring. Uh, if you're going to come, you have to bring an oil of three iya. Eisvei. Rabbi Yosef, Rabbi Yudo Imer. Sholosh regalim b'shanin and stav Yisrael lalis perregel. Jewish people were commanded three times to go up on Yontif. The Chag HaMatzah is Chag HaShvuz, Chag HaSukkos. The Einir and Chatzoyim. Half the people couldn't show up. It's got to be the majority. Yishim Shunem HaKol Zuchorcha. The Einir and Reikonim. You can't show up empty. Yishim Shunem HaVloi Reikon. So Reish Lokish wants to say to Rav Yechelon from here, it's clear, you can't come empty-handed. Rabbi Yechidim will answer, I'm a lay baker, I regal. That's only referring to the first day of Yontif. There's no raya for Cholomoy. Now we're going to turn the tables. Ace for Rav Yechidon, Lereish Lokish. Yireh, Yeroeh. We have a, just like you come to see, you come to be seen. Ma'ani bechinam, afatem bechinam. Listen, HaKadosh Baruch Hu shows his face and doesn't charge anything, you also can come to see me, it's free. So the din of Re'iyah's Re'iyah's pawning without Corbin, says Rabbi Yoichanan. Ella, kol heichad ha'asav lo aisi. If he comes, he doesn't bring, kol amalop ligadayo, he can come. Um is chaziv enofik, and he can be seen and leave. Ki pligi da'asav aisi. The Machlaika says he came and he brought something. Rav Yechidam had Riyas Ponim Bazara. Riyas Ponim Udein Lo Shir. How many times do you show your face as no Shir? Hala Korban Yesh Lo Shir. But the Korban itself has a Shir. But Reish Lakish, Omar Riyas Ponim Be Korban, Da Filu Korban Nami Ein Lo There's no Shir regarding the Korban either. You could bring as much as you want. Eisve. Hoi Karag Lecha Mi Beis Reyecha. in Mishle. Hashem is the Reya to is, is the friend to Israel. And you don't have to bring so many gifts to your friend. Where Lachura, it seems to imply not to bring so many korbanis. So Kabor says, Hasam Bachatis Fashomis. Yeah, there, the, Hashem doesn't want you to bring chattis as Hashem. It means you're doing averis. Rav Levi, Rav Levi, Yom Ksiv, Hoi Karay Lechabi Beis Riyach. Ksiv, Avo Veis Chab Oilois. No other person could bring Oilois. Like Kasha, Kan Bechatos Vashom. It's Kan Bechatos Vashlamim. Hashem wants Oilois Vashlamim. That you can bring a lot, as much as you want. But Chatos Vashom is better that you don't bring so much. Tain Amachi, Hoi Karay Lechabi Beis Riyach, Bechatos Vashom, it's a cause of a dabir. Seems to imply... Don't bring too many chatos v'shamos. Maybe atoy mer chatos v'shamos oin el ba'olus u'shlamim. Kishu oy mer avo beis chab oilus hashem lechad nedarai harei oilus u'shlamim amor aman mer kai moikar lechad beis reicha bechatos v'shamos akos b'davar. So the brisa agrees to the naskam of the gemara. Veinir and chatsoin. We said that the it shouldn't be only a part of the people come up aliyah leregel. If a son, if a father has 10 children, he shouldn't bring five today, five tomorrow. He should bring all 10. Which one of his children is he going to label negligent? And which one is he going to be, is going to, is going to label, you know, Zrizim magdimim le mitzvahs. You shouldn't delay doing mitzvahs. El akrola mayasa. So what's the pasuk to teach me? Lechadacherim. The tacherim oimim. 
See, these were people whose occupations made them smell. They gathered dung. They were coppersmiths. They were tanners. It's only a person who can walk with the majority of Klai Yisrael. You can't go up with Klai Yisrael. Klai Yisrael doesn't want them to walk with them because they smell. Now, Oilois Bamoyed, Bos Menachulim. So you're a farmer lives in Tel Aviv, and you produced a lot of grain, and you gave Meiser Rishon to the Levi, Truma to the Koi. Now you have Meiser Sheni, and you have too much grain, so you you pay an extra twenty percent, and you convert the kedusha of the Meiser Sheni to money. You bring up a lot of money to your shalayim. You cannot buy animals to be oilois during yontif, particularly we're talking about the oilois re'iya that come cholamoy, you can't buy that from Meister Shani money. It has to come from chulin money, from free and clear money, post-tax money. Rashi says, Kaimalan, Anything that there's a choiv, if there's a chiyuv that you got to bring it, it's got to come from chulin. You can't cover yourself with Sort of pre-tax dollars. You've already separated Meister Shani, so you could maybe you want to cover yourself with the Meister Shani money. You can't. Vashlomim and Meister, but Shlomim. Now again, I gave an overview about the three korbanos. This Shlomim we're talking about is the Shlomim Simcha. We need extra meat because we've got, we've got a big family. One Corbin Chagig is not to be enough. You can bring Shalmei Simcha. That Shlomim you can bring from Meister Shani money. Or for example, if you're a rancher and you separated Meister Behema, you can use, uh, and that's a Shlomim because Meister, Meister Behema is, is offered as a Shlomim. You could use that on Yontif. Now, Yontav Arishan Shal Pesach, Bishamay Oymi Minachulim. The Gemara will tell us what are we talking about? What 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 Corbin? Ubesal Oymi Minachulim. Then it says Yisrael Yotzin Dei Chovosim Benedorat and Dovsim Meiser Behema. In eating Shalmei Simcha, you can fulfill it if. If I had made a neder and an adava in my hometown months before, or all year. Now, what's the difference between a neder and an adava? A neder is when you say, Are a lie. It's on me. Are a lie shlamin. So then, therefore, if this animal gets lost, I got to bring another animal. A nadava is when you say, Are zu shlamin. You point to the animal. If it gets lost, I'm not a chay bechrayuso. But they're both creating shlamin. So those Nadav and Nadavos I can use for my Shalmei Simcha during Yontif. And I'm Yoytzei Simcha Sachag when it says V'somachta Bechagecha That's what we're talking about. We fulfill Simcha through eating meat. The Kiyuma Mitzvah is through eating meat. It's not by laughing and being happy. So I'm Makai in that Mitzvah with my with now, Kohanim also have a chi of simcha. Now, Kohanim, when a, when, a, when, a, when a Jew eats dam or is boil a knee done, is a beshoige, and he has to bring a korban chatas, Kohanim get to eat from that meat. Same thing with an asha. If you gave him a bachor and he offered it as a shlamim, he can eat from that. When you shecht your own chilim, chulim, and you have to give the koyin, the chaza, the, the breast, which is like the pastrami, the shok, and the thigh, he can be yotze shalmei simcha with these gifts. 
For example, chatas oif, a bird chatas, the coin cannot be be yotze shami simcha with chatas oif. Rashi says there's not enough pleasure, filling, satiation, only with psar behema. So it says oilois, the moed come from cholam ela oilois. Bemoyed who the boss menach. Let's call a moy. Habiyontif mina meiser. Does that imply that the ola that you have to bring the oil of reia can be brought from meiser? Amai davar shabachoyvi. Chol davar shabachoyvi. Na ba'alam anachol. So why did you say oil is bemoyed? It should say oil is beyontif. The chite ma kamash one the oilois bemoyed boys beyontif and boys. Maybe you want to tell me the Allah that in Cholamoid an oilus re'iya, if you didn't bring it prior, or you want to bring an oilus re'iya in Cholamoid, that has to come from Cholam. But an oilus re'iya in Yontif itself, maybe you don't, maybe you don't bring them at all. So who is that like? Come on, Kebe Shammai. There is a machloikas. Can you bring a korban shlomim on yontiv? Now, you do need to eat on yontiv. So, so Beishamai allows you to bring the shlomim, even though lachor it's extra work. However, in Mavin in Samcha, you don't do smicha. You don't lean on it. Because that's a rabbinic shvus. Because you're being mishtan, you're touching Balechayan. You don't write a behem. So when you were a medaik from our Mishnah, that you said beyond Tevain and Baos, you go like Beishamai. Because Beishamai says, Loi oilois. You don't bring an oila at all on Yontif. Because it says, Lachem, Velo Gavoa. Except for the Tomid and the Musaf, because it's tied to time. Even Meshavis, even Yontif. But a, an oila, which is donative, because even an oila, he is a donative. Beishamai says, Bring it Cholamoid, not Yontif. Beishamai allows you to bring it. On Yontif as well, and to be soimich. So the Gemara says, "Chaserim mechzer v'achik tomi." There's some words missing. Oilois nedorim unedoivos. If back home in Tel Aviv, I made a net there to bring an oilo. B'moy boys beyond the and boys. We only can bring them on Chol Moy Yontif. We can't bring them on Yontif itself. Oilos reiya. The korban of that you have to show up to the base of Midrash with an oil on Yontif, ba afilu be Yontif. That can be that kind of oil can be offered in even Yontif. And uchrishi ba, when that korban is brought in a ba'alim and achulim, that you got to come from post tax dollars. It can't come from previously separated meiser sheni or meiser beim or something like that. Now, this price continues. The shalme simcha. Right, we know what that we know what that is. These are the extra shlamim in order for us to eat meat. They can be brought even from Meiser Sheni. And we said you could bring them on Yontif. Even Beishamai said that because you want you can you need to eat on Yontif. Now, the third category that Kenny wanted, right? We had Oilus Riya that we've been dealing with in this Brisa. Shalmei Simcha. What about Chagigas Yontav Arishon Shal Pesach? So every Yontiv, you had a special din of being Chag the Yontiv. That is a Korban Chagiga. That's a Shlomei Chagiga. And the Iker Mitzvah is to bring it the first day Yontiv. The Chagosem also, the, the Mashma is to do it on Yom Rishon. Here it talks about Yontav Rishon Shal Pesach, but it could refer, refer to all of them. 
That has to come from Chulin. That can, you can also bring a Korban Shlom in Chagiga from pre-tax dollars, Meiser Be'ema or Meiser Sheni money. Tanya Ma'ochi, the Gemara says, another Baraisa, Oilus the Dormen Adovais, Bamoid Boys. You can bring an Oila, whether it's donative, on Cholomoid. But beyond it, since it's donative, in and both. You don't need an Oila. So it's not needed. Any, any. Any, so you had a huge amount of korbanos on the first day of Yontif, the first day of Pesach. So you had the you had the, the korban Pesach. We're not even talking about the korban Pesach. No, exactly. I'm, I'm saying you had the korban Pesach. Yeah, but you finished that Friday the night before. Night before, and then you had this huge amount of korbanos that you was everybody was hired to bring it. We're going to learn something else on Pesach, besides something called Chagiga Tesvav, there was something called Chagiga Yudalin. Besides the Korban Pesach, you were required to bring a Korban Chagiga on Yudalin. Yudalin was a Chag. Now, why did you need that meat? You're going to tell me. Because the Korban Pesach was eaten a la soiva. Had to be eaten as dessert. So you needed a whole meat, a whole bunch of meat, before you ate the Korban Pesach. So that, that was a Chagiga Yudalin. That wasn't even Shalmei Simcha. That was a special mitzvah to bring Korban Chagiga. And, and, and you had to bring that mamash in the in the in the base of Mikdash. Erev, it's a Korban Chagiga was slaughtered. Uh, I understand. Because the dam, and, the meat is, and the meat is taken back to your hotel. Yeah, how many means? How many means? You needed so many meat. How do you do that for everybody? Well, you, had drop, you, you had drop cloud Israel. No, the meach is a yuma it's 30 to 64 feet by 60. It's the size of a football field. Huge. So hang on. So that meat, you probably, because it's noise, so you can't leave it over to the next day. So the Chagiga Yudal was finished the night of. The Korban Bezak was finished the night of. Chagiga's Tezvav was the meat you ate lunchtime, first day of Pesach. So the oil of of course, you could bring Yontif. The shlamin that you needed for extra meat could come from Meiser Sheni. The Chagiga Siyontav Arishon Shal Pesach, what we call the Chagiga Tezvav. What is this? Uh, what is this Chagigas uh, Yontov Rishon Shul Pesach from a regular Chagiga of other Yomim Toivim? Oh, on Ravashi Hakamashma Chagigas Chamishas are in Chagigas Abos are low. The Korban Chagiga, the Shlomim of the Chagiga that comes from Yom Tov Rishon of Pesach, yes, could come. Beishamai said from Chulin, but the Chagiga Yudalid, when you had the Korban Pesach and you didn't have enough meat, they had to bring another, that, Chagiga Basar, that's Ein Chiyav Lavi Yesmin Achulin, it's only, because it's not a Choyva Gemura. You only would bring a Chagiga Yudalid if you calculated that the amount of people that signed up to your Korban Pesach was too many, and they're not going to have enough meat to fill themselves up. Then you have to bring a Chagiga Yudala to fill up and eat the Korban Pesach as a dessert. So it's not really a Chov, it's a Rishus. Since it's not a Rishus, it can come from Meister Behema and Meister Shani money. Very, Al Maksar Chagiga Sarbas or Labda Raisa. That Chagiga Yudala was not Midat Toira. And therefore you could bring it even from the Meister. Okay. Phew. Yeah. Right, let's go. Go ahead. Good stuff. Thank you. Yeah.